Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Danica and I'm the Fit Mom Lifestyle on Instagram, LTK, and TikTok. And today I'm back with a Lululemon Outfits of the Week video. So, in today's video, I have actually one workwear outfit, a couple of um, workout outfits, and then just a few casual, I believe. I always film the first outfit of the video last, fun fact. So anyway, I we're about to lose light. It's crazy how fast the sun is setting, but I'm going to go pick up my son here in a bit and I wanted to share what I am wearing. But if you love Lululemon, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell because I come out with at least one new Lululemon video every single week. I actually alternate. So, um, one Sunday I'll do a Lululemon outfits of the week and then the following Sunday you can expect a haul. So that's kind of what I do here and it's lots of fun. I try to show you what I'm wearing and hopefully incorporate pieces from like the most recent hauls. Obviously that doesn't always happen, but anyway, that's kind of the plan. So let's get into today's outfit. Like I said, I'm about to head out, go get my son, um, after school and things like that. And then I have a couple errands to run. So here's what I have on, on top. This is actually a men's fleece. I think it's called, it's either a half zip or a quarter zip. I'm not sure. I'll have it linked down below and I can get these in a medium or a large. I actually have a few colors. I believe this one is in a medium, but I also have a few larges that I share with my husband because oftentimes like for sweatshirts like this, we'll just share. So I got this one last year and I really love it. It is so cozy, but they came out with it again this year in some new colors. So very excited that they brought it back. I think this is really, really cute. I know it's just a basic, but I just really like it. It does have pockets on the side. They're zippered, so, and it's actually just like one big kangaroo pocket, so love that, very cute. I personally, sometimes I'm just not in the mood for like a hooded sweatshirt or jacket or anything, so I really like crew necks, but I feel like having a collar just like dresses it up a little bit, you know, like a crew neck I usually lounge around the house in, but something like this I just feel like looks a little bit more put together and cute to go out and about. So um, that's what I have on top. Underneath I actually just have the Align V-neck bra. I really love these. I have these in quite a few colors now because I think they're super versatile. I will wear them for like a day like this for just running errands. I'll wear them for lower intensity workouts. Um, I'll wear them around the house. Like I just think they're really, really great. They're also really cute if you wanna pair it with like a matching pair of aligns, aligned leggings or aligned shorts. I think it's a really cute look for a lower intensity workout. So really love, really cute. Highly recommend those. And then I just have on some Align 25 inch high rise leggings. I guess I could show you, you can kind of see the bra. Um, and then just my Align pants. And then I have these slippers on. Like I said, I'm just gonna kind of run out the door and then I have like a Target pickup. So um, this is what I have on, very casual, very comfy, and I just really love these pieces. So um, I we're gonna get in today's haul, or not haul, outfits of the week, but I did also wanna mention we've got Vlogmas coming up. I have some posts down below that I've gotten together, some holiday PJs, things like that. So lots of fun things to check out um, as we head into the holiday season. So thanks so much for being here and let's get into the next outfit. Good morning. So here is today's outfit for work. It's a little bit dark in here this morning, but first on top, I have the all aligned mock neck. I get these in a size 10. This one is a couple years old, I believe. And this one I think is in red Merlot. I love these so much. I think they're really cute. I think you can dress them up like I am today for work, but you can also wear them with groove pants, aligned pants, other soft stream pants, these are soft stream pants today. Um, there's just so many ways you can style this. You can also work out in it if you like. It is new loose, so I would be careful if you are working out in it. It is delicate, so you don't wanna rub anything um, against it, but I absolutely love these. I tend to wear them more like this in kind of like a business casual, like dressier environment. So that's what I have on top. Love these and super, super comfortable. And then these are soft stream pants actually. These again are a little bit of an older version. So I think currently 
They might only have the full length, but these are the crop version and they don't have any like draw cord or anything here, which I think makes them look a little bit more dressy. Obviously the regular soft stream are just fine and if you're in a more casual environment, that may be okay. For me, I need something a little bit dressier. So this looks nice. It's got like some kind of pleats and I just think it looks really cute and perfect for a business casual environment. So that's what I have on today. I've got some, I'll, I'll link these Steve Madden shoes and these are my Anna Luisa earrings. I'm partnered with them a while ago and I absolutely love these. I think they're so, so pretty. So I'll link those as well, but this is today's outfit for work. All right, so here is today's outfit for CrossFit. So I'm actually really excited because these Swiftly high neck tanks are currently on sale. They're available and pretty well stocked, at least at the time of filming, in black, white, and gray, which one makes me very excited because obviously I wanna buy a couple more on sale, but two, I'm worried that they're getting rid of these items. So if you like the high neck, tank which I absolutely love especially for high intensity workouts if you're deadlifting or do it even like yoga if you're bending over and you want that extra coverage these are so great they have that um, antibacteria technology and so they're going to kind of wick away sweat and they're not going to smell if you wear them like today I'm going to wear this for the gym and then we're going to go run errands after so it's just great for that I love the swiftly technology and I just can't believe these are on sale but I'm sad that they may be getting rid of them. So hopefully they're just like relaunching. I would love if they did, cause this is the rank, the race length. I would love if they did like the cropped length, like they've done in the long sleeves and the short sleeves. That would be really cool, but who knows, we'll see. Um, and then, so I have these in a size eight and then under that I just have an energy bra in the color black in a size 10. And then I've got my um, Wonder Train high rise six inch shorts in a size eight as well. I've got my strong feel, I'm, oh my gosh, what am I saying? I've got my power tab socks on. I was going to say that I think I'm gonna wear my strong feels, but there is some running in today's workout. Um, so I may do the charge feels regardless. I'll have both linked down below. I do have a shoe video where I went over like all the different shoes and how I personally wear them from Lululemon. So I'll have that linked in the cards and below if you want to check that out. But essentially I wear the strong feels if I'm doing a lot of lifting and I wear the charge feels if it's more like an overall training day with lifting and like some sort of running where I want a little bit more support. And then I also do have the bliss feels, which is the running shoe, which to be honest, I don't wear a ton because I don't wear those for running. I more so wear those for like walking or casually like athleisure and stuff like that. So anyway, the more I talk about it, the more I think I'm actually going to wear the charge feels for today's workout. But anyway, I will have both the charge feels and the strong feels listed below as shoe options. I'm also going to throw on a scuba. So I'll have that below. I think I'm just going to do a half sip today. Um, but this is today's outfit and I really hope that these um, tanks are still available because I highly recommend and I already own black and white and I think I'm just gonna pick up gray although I'm like should I pick up another white because sometimes white shirts you know I don't know but anyway highly recommend and I love this tank good morning here is today's outfit so we are actually about to head out my son has t-ball and then swim and then we have a couple of errands to run so today's gonna be kind of like a busy well this morning will be a busy active morning and this is what I decided to wear it's about like 68 but it's going to get up to 75 so i thought this was an appropriate outfit i'm going to be sitting in the sun for like an hour so i was like you know what it's gonna warm i'm gonna feel warm so first on top i have this swiftly tech cropped short sleeve i really really like this and i really like how it looks with these pants so these are the groove pants i get these in a size eight this is in the color smoked spruce these are from last year but this is extremely similar to this year's Dark Forest. So I really do still love the groove pants and I think part of why I love it, love them is because they are super high rise. So for me, I have a long torso, but they, so my belly button is just, just below, whereas some people like it's halfway up, you know, to their bra or whatever. But for me, it just covers my belly button, which I personally really love because I think it helps with my proportions so because these go high rise and they're to like the smallest point of my waist 
I feel like they definitely elongate my legs and then this hits right at the top of it and so this actually shortens my torso and this lengthens my legs so it actually is um, kind of like changes the perspective on my proportions because I actually have a long torso and shorter legs but this basically like I don't want to say fixes that but doesn't make it look like that so if you have similar proportions to me and you have a longer torso and shorter legs and you actually want to accentuate your legs and make your torso look shorter try doing something like this where you wear a little bit more of a cropped top tank long sleeve whatever it is and higher waisted pants and especially if you can add a flare at the bottom that's obviously even more of a bonus because the flare at the bottom makes your legs look even longer so just a little style tip for you here but I love how this kind of like changes my proportions and um yeah just really cute and comfy so back to this top I have this in a size 12 I size up it is a little bit I don't know what is going on with my camera I feel like it's the settings are off or something um it is a little bit loose here in the stomach area but honestly I don't care I personally like the size 12 because I have broader shoulders and I just want a little bit more room here I hate feeling like constricted and claustrophobic in my shoulders so anyway um and then I just have a like a cloud bra underneath if you know me you know I love these like a cloud bras I basically live in them seriously I don't know this is like not focusing it's like focusing on everything but what I'm talking about so <laughs> sorry about that my camera is struggling this morning but this is my outfit for just like mom life today basically. I actually think I'm going to throw on my Bliss Feel um, shoes from Lululemon because like I said we're going to be like at the local high school. We're going to be walking around the grass and I think I just want to be in like active wear, act athletic shoes. Or maybe I'll throw on my Hoka's too. I'll link both below. I'm really not sure what I'm going to do. I have my Hoka Clifton's that I really love. Those are in white though so I kind of feel like I don't know if I want to wear white, whereas my Lululemon Bliss Feels are black, so I feel like that would pull in the black from the shirt. So I might do the Bliss Feels, but we'll see. I'll link them both below for you. This is my outfit, and yeah, I'm excited for today. I think it's going to be a really great it's Saturday, so a really great Saturday, and I'll see you in the next outfit. Hello, so here is today's outfit for CrossFit. If you've been around for a while, this will come to no surprise. I've been a set girl this whole fall. Like, Wonder Train, High Rise, wait, Wonder Train, Racer Rack, Tank, and Wonder Train, High Rise, Shorts in either the 6 inch, the 4 inch, or the 25 inch leggings. This is the Wonder Train Racer Rack Tank in a size 10 in the color Dramatic Magenta. These are the Wonder Train High Rise 6 inch shorts in a size 8 in the color Dramatic Magenta. And this has been my go to, like, I don't have to think about it. Grab and go. I know it's going to be durable. I know I'm going to feel comfortable and confident in it. And it's really cute. So this has just been like honestly my uniform for like high intensity workouts the last few months. Like I have this dramatic magenta set. I have a black one. I have a medium forest one. I have a java one. Um, I have like a few other ones from like previous years. So anyway... I have just been loving and living in these sets. They are so great. I also am really loving this dramatic magenta color. I slept on this color. Oftentimes when it comes to Lululemon, I like, sometimes I'll see a color and I'm like, oh, that's like, it's pretty, but like not for me when I see it on the website. And then I go in the store and I see it in person and I'm like, oh my God, that's beautiful. <laughs> so that's what happened with this color. When I saw it online, I just didn't, I just kind of overlooked it and then when I saw it in store I was like oh my god I need that so this is what I have on for CrossFit today I've got my power tab socks as well I love these I'm gonna throw on my strong feel shoes today we are doing bench press thrusters wall walks and pull-ups so this is my outfit for that I like wearing these darker colors when we're going to be on the floor so like for the wall walks will kind of be obviously like we we finish on the floor so I could get a little bit dirty I also like that this is more durable um and then like obviously with the bench press and stuff if I have the barbell on my chest this is going to be fine as opposed to wearing like Nulu or something so anyway this is my outfit for today. I really love it. I think it's so pretty 
and so excited. I think it's also going to be really fun in the summer. I mentioned this in my haul when I got these. My last haul, I believe it was. I'll link it in the cards and below if you want to check it out. But I have a lot of other lavender colors that I got this past summer. I believe I have lavender dew. I forget. I forget, honestly, all the colors because I have a couple different ones from different years. But I think in the summer, it'll be really fun to wear, like I could wear this top with some lighter, um... I have some track that high rise three inch shorts that'll look really cute with it. And then I could wear like these bottoms with, I have a, um, an Ebb to street racerback crop tank in like a lighter lavender. So I think it's going to be fun to mix and match. Um, I think this darker set is really beautiful for fall and winter, but I am excited to bring it into spring and summer and also do like whites. I think this color looks so pretty with white and light heather gray, like this with the light heather gray scuba would look really cute. So anyway, um, I just think this is a really beautiful, versatile color and I'm very excited about it. So that is it for today's outfit. All right, so here is today's Lululemon outfit. I realized I've been wearing lots of like browns and greens, but I mean, it's fall, so it's good. Um, first on top, I have this all yours long sleeve in black. This is in a size eight. It's just cozy, comfy, and a good, easy basic. Under that, I have my Like a Cloud bra. I think this is in cacao, um, which is just kind of like a good tan shade for me. And I have these in a size 12. I size up one just so that they're extra comfy. And then on bottom, I have my Inner Glow High Rise 3 inch shorts. These I think are in a size 8 in the color Nomad. And they're just really cute and comfy. And I love them for a casual day like today. It's currently Sunday and I'm actually just going to take my son to drop him off at my parents house for a little bit so I can get some stuff done here around the house so very casual literally just running out the door to do that maybe do like a target pickup and run some errands and stuff but then I'll just be home um, I'm gonna do a crock pot dinner tonight I'm really excited about it so anyway this is just my outfit for like a casual Sunday all right, so I actually wanted to show you tomorrow's workout for F45. I have been going to F45 early in the morning, like either 5 or 6 a.m., and obviously it's too dark and I'm half asleep at that time, so I can't show you my outfit. And then by the time I get home, I'm either like sweaty and gross or I'm rushing to get to work. So I never have the opportunity to show you my outfits for F45 if I go to a morning class. So I wanted to show you what I'm planning to wear tomorrow morning. It's going to be a little bit cooler, obviously at that time of the day, it always is, but also tomorrow is a lifting day and I believe we get to choose, um, there's like two different circuits and you get to choose if you want to do upper body or lower body. And I think I'm going to do upper body tomorrow. That's my plan depending on the actual like exercises, but I'm thinking I'm going to do upper body. So this is what I'm planning to wear. So on top, I have the Swiftly Tech Long Sleeve 2.0 Crop. I really love these. I have these in like four colors. I know it's really hard to see when it's all black, but I have these in this specific top in like four colors, and I also have the short sleeve. I am a fan of the Swiftly Tech fabric. I love the technology. I love that I can wear them to work out, but I also wear them casually or like on Sundays or whatever if I'm going to be running errands but then maybe going for a family walk and then like you know what I mean it's just they're so versatile so I also think they're cute and flattering so this is a size 12 obviously in the color black I love where it hits on me personally it is a little bit loose in the waist because if I were going based on my waist I'd be more like a size 8 so there is a little bit of room here but I personally don't mind I think it's fine I think it's cute and I just size up for my shoulders because I like more room and more mobility in my shoulders. Also, I would not be doing an upper body day in a long sleeve if it were too constricting, personally. Like, I just need to be able to move. So, that's what I have on top. Under that, I actually have the Wonder Train Strappy Bra. I actually really, really like this bra. And um, I have it in black and white. This one's obviously in black. Um, I get these in my true size 10. And I think they're really great. I personally, okay, they're basically like a flow wide bra, but more durable and for a little bit of a bigger cup size. So the flow wide bra just does not work for me. 
It doesn't give me enough lift. This is still like a very thin strap, but it is the Everlux material as opposed to the Nulu material. So it is a little bit more compressive. Therefore, it's going to lift a little bit more and just like hold you in a little bit better. And I just feel like the um, like width of the actual bra is a little bit bigger because it's made for, I believe, either BC or CD cups. I forget. But anyway, it just, if you, if the flow Y bra has never worked for you, maybe try this. Now I would not run in this personally, um, unless I were wearing it with another bra. So like, for example, if I were wearing this under the Wonder Train Racerback or under an Ebb to Street, right? up to street racer back crop tank like I might wear this for extra support but I would not wear this on its own for running I'll wear it on its own for lifting casually things like that but just for me this one like tiny strap is not like enough for a ton of movement you know what I mean or at least that's just not my preference so just a little background on that and then I actually just have on these align um 25 inch pants these are a little bit older and so Oh, there we go. That's better. Um, I'm not super worried about, like, obviously I don't want to ruin them, but I've had these for a few years, so I don't mind working out in them. I wouldn't, I personally wouldn't take like a brand new pair of Align leggings and work out in them just because I like to keep them nice because I wear them casually. But these are a little bit older. I've had them for a while, and if I like, you know, pill a little bit, it's going to be fine. I also, though, plan to do upper body, so I don't think I'll have like a ton of going on down here like I'm not going to be doing deadlifts or anything like that so um I'm not too worried about it but that being said I did just want to mention that whenever um Black Friday and Boxing Day the day after Christmas come around Lululemon generally does a huge sale and actually that's when I got these um, align leggings. I believe the line leggings usually go down to like $69, $79, something like that. So, um, they don't do, just in case you're interested, they don't do like a full, um, like site wide sale. They usually just add more to their sale section. So what you would normally see on a Thursday at Lululemon, you're just going to see a lot more of that. Like, so usually I believe there's 300 to 400 items on sale and usually for the women specifically and usually for Black Friday and Boxing Day there's like closer to a thousand so I just want to mention that because I will probably be looking at the aligns and picking up some more aligns because if I'm wearing them for like lifting and stuff I don't really care the color of the pattern um, and if I can get them on sale then I'm more likely to wear them lifting so I know this was a very long clip but clearly I've had a lot of coffee and I'm feeling energized and I'm excited to share this stuff with you because all these sales and holiday events and things like that are coming up and I just want to add one more note on the like with the holidays coming I have I'll link down below um, a couple of lists that I've been putting together I'm working on my gift guides I don't think those will be done yet if they are they'll be listed below but check for the next few videos because they will be coming soon but below I have started like um, saving my favorite holiday PJs. So if you're interested in getting those, because I know those sell out quick. So I have a list, a, like a gift guide of holiday PJs. I also have a gift guide of really cute holiday outfit pieces. So like think Fair Isle sweaters and just like pretty red sweaters or whatever. Some dresses, more so on the casual end because that's just how I live. I'm a little bit more casual. Um, and then I also have like just fun festive finds. So think about like the anthropology mugs or anthropology candles or some Target mugs. So I've kind of just started pulling together some fun like holiday themed things. And I want those out sooner because obviously you want to start wearing and enjoying those things throughout the month of December, not like Christmas, not like on Christmas. So anyway, all that will be below. And then once my gift guides are out, if they're not already, they'll be out probably by next week. Um, that'll be really fun as well. I have a lot coming. So I know this was very long winded. Thanks for sticking with me. Um, and that's actually the last, this is the last outfit for this video. So I appreciate you so, so much. Get excited for Vlogmas coming very soon. If you have any video ideas, suggestions, anything like that, any specific gift guides you want me to create, please put it in the comments down below. Thank you for doing those things. I'm so excited and I'll see you in my next video.